Good evening, everybody. Welcome to Bobby Two Pops and Breaks. It is a Friday, and it's February the 22nd. It's actually 23rd. It's 1 a.m. Central. We are breaking bomb box, autographed jerseys, two-box break here. We did random team sales, you can see on the right. Already randomized both the teams and the customers, alphabetized them afterwards. Give me ample opportunity to trade, but I don't. Uh, the trades have been entered. Don't see anything else happening. Just checking YouTube real quick. Uh, Facebook's down right now. So here we go, folks. We would normally random up our boxes in the case, but these are the last two boxes. So here we go. Starting a fresh case after this. Gonna pop your security seal. All right, hang on, we just had a confirmation. Hit. Oh, there we go. All right, guys. Here we go. Again, we've got open our box. No peeking. Bam! Well, guys, gonna be a Atlanta Falcons hit, folks. Ticket number eight. That there is gonna be the Dante Hall, folks. But I'm telling you, guys, man, this fucking jersey is something else, man. May not be the highest end name, but wow, man, I'm telling you, this jersey is really. It's something, boys. I'm telling you, man. This thing weighs like a friggin' comforter. Uh, it's one of the old Reebok folks. You know, the big old heavy Reebok guys. Beautiful jersey. It has all the Reebok tags, everything, folks. Telling you, don't think this is a China man. This is a really, really nice friggin' jersey, guys. Gonna be Dante Hall, Atlanta Falcons. Very nice a jersey, y'all. JSA certification. Is it D'Angelo or Dante? I forget. Yep, I thought it was Dante Hall. It might be D'Angelo. I thought it was Dante. Um, who has Atlanta? Who the hell has Atlanta? There's going to be a state of hockey hit, but there is no other ticket in there. Like I said, it's actually a nice quality jersey there, state. Again, maybe not the super highest end, but D'Angelo. D'Angelo Hall, sorry. Uh, yep, D'Angelo Hall, sorry, guys. But you know, I'm telling you guys, this jersey is something else, man. That thing is a monster. Um, I'm sure I am. Bob's going to be bothering you for that state. Uh, Bob Boca in the Facebook group. So, let me show you. Bam! Well, folks, nice hit again. It's going to be Mr. Jared Allen. Welcome to the room, DH. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. You gave the spots away. <laughs> that is going to be a Jared Allen hit right at the top for Mr. DH Card Hunts, man. Yep, don't even know if he realized he won it. I don't see him on the roster there anymore. But congrats, bud, guys. Well, that was just an okay case for the series, guys, actually. I was sort of surprised that there wasn't more in there, like I said. But that's going to bode well for our next five cases, all I can say, man.
going to do our man cave light, guys. Um, yep. It was actually just an okay case for the series, I guess, in some ways, guys. We did have Baron Rogers and uh, Joe Namath in the same friggin' series there. Or in the same case. <laughs> All right, here we go, folks. Man Cave Light Qualifier 7. 1. You haven't stayed? I'm going to get a chance. Check your I am. Seven times. Wow, guys. Noah's going to be our qualifier. It is qualifier number five. First two were exclusive. Third was SD, State of Hockey. And number five, Noah H, folks.